What's up, everybody? Hey, welcome back to the show. By the way, Merry Christmas. We're in the holiday season here. Just uh, Christmas was yesterday. And uh, I'm actually recording this on, on Christmas Eve here. Of course, last minute, just like my shopping, I'm recording my Christmas segment for um, the Flip Nerd Show uh, on Christmas Eve. But at any rate, I wanted to share this can actually be a two part series um, that we're going to share with you over the next two episodes. And I'm going to talk about uh, a quote that I saw yesterday that just kind of impacted me in a, in a profound way. I kept reading it. I kept thinking about it. And I thought it would make for a great little segment here. It's a quote from Pablo Picasso that says, The meaning of life is to find your gift. The purpose of life is to give it away. And that's what we're going to talk about for the next two episodes, starting with the second part. The purpose of life is to give it away. Give your knowledge away. Welcome to Real Estate Investing Secrets. We're all looking for freedom and the opportunity to live better, more fulfilling lives. But most of us were trained our entire lives to work for someone else and chase their dreams. How can we use real estate investing as a vehicle to achieve financial freedom? My life is dedicated to answering your real estate investing questions and helping you build an investing business that allows you to change your life and the world around you and to enable you to turn your dreams of financial freedom into a reality. My name is Mike Cambright from FlipNerd.com and your questions get answered here on the Real Estate Investing Secrets Show. All right, all right, guys. So this is the uh, first video in a two-video series that is breaking down a quote that I, that I just saw last night, actually, and it really impacted me in a profound way. And it was a quote from Pablo Picasso. The quote's obviously been around for a long time. I just had never seen it before. And it really kind of moved me. I was sitting there and just kept thinking about it and um, thought about it while I was sleeping last night, waking up, thinking about it. And I was like, I need to create some uh, some content on this. And it's going to be a two-part series. And I'll, I'll tell you the quote here, and then we'll kind of dig in. So the quote is, again, from Pablo Picasso. The quote is, the meaning of life is to find your gift and the purpose of life is to give it away. So find out what your gift is. Become an expert in something that you uh, were meant, you were created to know, and then share that with others. So what I'm going to do in uh, this video, this is the first of two parts, is I'm actually going to share uh, some thoughts, some kind of deep thoughts, if you will, on the second part. To The purpose of life is to give it away. It's referring to the first part, which is the meaning of life is to find your gift, which is find your passion, find what you're good at, find something that not only helps you and benefits you, but if you share that with others, it'll benefit them too. It'll benefit your community, maybe everybody around you, right? So the purpose of life is to give it away. And the reason that this has hit, hit home with me quite a bit is because, and by the way, in the next couple of episodes, I want to share some great nuggets for you guys, some great resources that will help you. Uh, on your journey. And not that I'm all knowing, but I'm just going to share my lessons, right? I've been a real estate investor for 12 years now. I've flipped hundreds of houses. And more importantly, I've helped thousands of other real estate investors get started and build their business and try to reach their goals. Now, I'm not responsible for their goals. They are, you are, if you're listening to this, but I've, I've really helped a lot of people kind of get started and how far they took that is up to them. Okay. But I definitely have mentored and coached a lot of successful people. This isn't about me. What I'm telling you is that when you give your information away, um, sometimes, and I dealt with this early on as a coach, is that it hurt my heart when somebody didn't see the level of success um, that they wanted. And I think what I'm going to tell you right now, uh, this isn't the this isn't the uh, entire episode. I don't want to be focused on this. But when a, a lot of us, when if you're a teacher. If you, uh, if you do a bunch of charitable things, there's a lot of things that we do because we feel like we're trying to help other people. And what you're going to find in this journey is that whoever it is that you're trying to help, it's often going to be the case that you want it more than they want it. And that hurt my heart for a long time uh, when I saw people fail or people you know, just not listening to anything that we're saying. And what, what I've realized is, is you can't want it as the, t as the teacher, the person that's sharing your knowledge, any of those things, you can't want it more than they want it. And that is a common thing. It's just, it's just the, the unfortunate truth that there's a lot of people that don't feel enough pain to take risk. They're okay 
with where they're at. Okay, so let's kind of get that out of the way. Uh, a little nugget that I want to share with you, by the way, is um, I'm part of a very giving group in this industry of real estate investors, many uh, highly sought after influencers, practitioners uh, that share information. So I want to give you a little nugget here as we're uh, getting started in this episode is um, if you weren't part of it, we recently held a two day online uh, summit, really 10 speaker series from many of the top kind of influencers and real estate investors in the country, including guys like uh, John Martinez, Trevor Mock with Investor Carrot, and many, many more. I won't name them all here, but many more. 10 top speakers talked um, a lot about lead generation, lead conversion, business operations, how to kind of improve your operations. And the event was totally free. It was streamed live. And actually, literally right now, as we're speaking right now, as I'm recording this, we just launched the uh, version that you can go to that's uh, the recorded version. So if you go to newyearfreedom.com, newyearfreedom.com, just like it sounds, and uh, opt in, you're going to get immediate access to all 10 of the recordings. No strings attached, just great information. There's actually nothing in there uh, for sale. Everybody that was there has things for sale. Now, that's another um, thing that I want to get into here. So go check out newyearfreedom.com. Is that some people think that, well, uh, just like we're saying here, the purpose of life is to give it away, to give it away, to give your knowledge away, to share your knowledge. Now, this quote doesn't say give it away for free. You should be willing to give everything you have for free to other people. Because at the end of the day, we're all business people. We need to make money. Now, this is episode, I think, number 501. We recorded our 500th episode of the Flip Nerd uh, REI Secret Show last week. And actually, as we speak right now, literally almost to the day, this is our uh, six-year anniversary at Flip Nerd. Six years, pretty cool, actually. Uh, it's actually kind of hard to believe when I think about six years. Wow, that's gone by fast. Uh, but we've shared over 1,500 videos for free, a lot of free information. Um, and there's nothing wrong with giving away a lot of free information, by the way. And you should know, and I don't, I don't say this to brag or anything like that, but that that stuff comes at an expense. I've spent millions of dollars building Flipner, rebuilding it, paying a team, uh, lots of other things to uh, to create effectively free content, right? So um, the business side of it, you know, at the end of the day, I want to give away a lot of free stuff because I really do love giving away, but the business has to support itself. So we also sell products. We sell training. We have masterminds now, investor fuel, things like that. There are things that I sell, sell, and they're much, uh, I think the free content is really good, but there's just not as much handholding and um, interaction, right? When, when products are free. Um, and so uh, that that's basically another thing that I want to touch on here is that if you find your craft, if you find something that you're passionate about that you want to share with other people, you don't have to give it away for free. In fact, you can't give it away for free. Now, let me liken this to being in an airplane and um, what's what do they tell you during the uh, safety instructions? That in the event that the plane loses pressure, that you need oxygen, right? Everybody needs to breathe. You need to put your own life mask on first. That's a fact even for your children. You can't help them if you're dead, right? And so at the end of the day, from a business standpoint, if you give away all of your information for free all the time and you never charge for anything, you'll die. And I'm not saying that for selfish reasons. I'm saying that because if you have something that you really need to share, you need to be able to monetize that. You need to be able to monetize that because if not, the sharing will stop because from a business standpoint, you will die. You'll have to earn a living doing other things. You have to cover your costs doing other things. And so it's really, really important that you find a way to do something that you're passionate about, that you can share freely and have an opportunity for others to pay you. If Now in the real estate world, what's the implication? We want to help a lot of sellers. It's really your job to help others, to help sellers out of difficult situations, right? But you can't give that away for free every time. You should always lead with your heart and give the very best that you can, but there's nothing wrong with you monetizing those deals uh, when they come about. And the truth is, is of the hundreds of houses that I purchased, nobody ever came to us after the fact or anywhere near the closing time and was angry that we were doing something that we were making money on or 
anything like that. It's just, it's literally never happened. Now, are there leads that we've gone on that the person thought that, well, you're just trying to steal my house. And like, well, we didn't set the expectations up up front that we buy at a discount. And we very much go out of our way to say that our offer probably won't work for you because it doesn't work for most people. Um, but there are some people that we don't buy their house that are angry sometimes. If you don't do a good job of setting expectations, that'll happen. But everybody that we actually bought a house from is glad that we've solved their problem. Okay, so there's nothing wrong with that. I just want to clear that mindset for where you are. Now, I'm going to tell you too that I believe this uh, with every ounce of my being because this is what I've done, is after you get good at real estate investing, after you learn how to help people, you should find a way to share that knowledge with other people, which is what I've done. It doesn't mean that everybody and their brother needs to go out and be a coach, which is kind of what we see these days, especially if you've hardly done anything. But essentially what I'm trying to share with you is that I believe that you have an obligation to share what you know with other people. It could be at your local RIA club. It could be in a Facebook group. It could be anywhere, right? Meeting for coffee and sharing things with someone else. So I can tell you that I firmly believe that this real estate investing industry has made a ma massive transformation over the last four or five years, going from um, usually a lot of uh, selfish actions, people that are just out for themselves, to this community now that I'm a part of, of people that, and, I'm, and by the way, I'm not saying that that doesn't still exist, but the undertones were even are people at the top, leaders in kind of this industry, also selfish people. And I'm not saying that they were selfish people, but they felt it just feels different now. There's this culture of sharing, and I think it's helped by uh, social media, social media and how easy it is to get your message across. And people gravitate towards positivity and towards uh, sharing and putting good out there. So I'm kind of rambling now, but at this point, we're talking about Pablo, Pablo Picasso's quote that I saw last night. The meaning of life is to find your gift. The purpose of life is to give it away. I've really been focused on kind of giving and sharing and being able to share with one another. In the next episode, this is a two-part series, I'm going to talk more about finding your gift. Okay. So uh, in closure here with the purpose uh, of life is to give your knowledge away. Thank you for following me at Flip Nerd as we kind of end the year here. I'm very grateful that we have been doing this for six years now and literally have millions and millions of downloads, millions of video views on YouTube, and um, lots of amazing content on flipnerd.com. So I, I wanna give away one more thing here before we end. So first off, go to newyearfreedom.com. You can sign up for the recent event that we had online, get immediate access to 10 presentations from a whole bunch of uh, industry leaders, newyearfreedom.com. Of course, you can find a lot of free information on flipnerd.com. We have over 1,500 video shows on uh, real estate investing. Shows like this really have a whole lot of interviews and, ex and tips from experts all around the industry. The last thing I want to share with you is uh, if you send a message to support at flipnerd.com, that is our support line, support at flipnerd.com, and say, I'm interested in Mike's New Year offer is I'm about to put something out. This is not a, a free thing. It's fantastic uh, what I'm, what I'm going to offer here. I'm not going to go into detail on it here, but I have this amazing offer that I'm putting out and uh, it'll be a much, much higher price. Um, but I want to get about um, 50 people in to beta test this offer. And it really is insane. It's a, and we're going to offer it at 90% off of the, um, of what we charge for it currently. And it actually has some free bonuses as well that are super, super high value. Um, so I'm really looking for 50 people that are interested in some more handholding and really access to an amazing community of real estate investors. So send a message to support at flipnerd.com and uh, just say I'm interested in Mike's new year offer. And uh, I'm kind of making this up as I go along because I'm thinking, I haven't told my team I'm doing this yet. Um, but I know exactly what I'm doing. So send that a message and then we'll follow up with you within the next uh, week here and let you know. So for right here, we're at Christmas Eve. Uh, this is going to come out uh, first week of January. So if you're hearing this after that, it's probably too late. Uh, but if you can message support at flipnerd.com and we'll set you up with this amazing offer, tell you more about it. So I appreciate you a ton. Thanks for following me along for all these years or however long you've been following me for. I hope you continue to follow me for a number of years because I'm not going away. I'm going to keep sharing my knowledge, sharing my resources, sharing my connections with you and bringing great value. So 
Happy holidays. We got the new year coming up here quickly. Hopefully you're working on some goal planning. In the next episode, part two of this series, I'm going to talk about this, the first part of Pablo, Pablo Picasso. That's a tongue twister's uh, quote. The meaning of life is to find your gift, to find uh, the knowledge that can impact others. We'll talk about it then. See you on the next episode. Thanks for listening to today's show. There are three ways I can help you start or grow your real estate investing business. If you're a new investor and just getting started, the Flip Nerd Investor Coaching Program is the most effective program in America. I've been coaching and mentoring new real estate investors for 10 years, and my students have literally purchased thousands and thousands of properties. Many of them started with little to no experience at all. Our program is a paint by numbers program where we tell you exactly what to do week by week to make sure that you don't get distracted on your way to results. We show you how to build a real business, not just create another job for yourself. New memberships are limited. You can learn more and apply or schedule a call with me and my team at flipnerd.com slash coaching. If you're an experienced investor doing a minimum of 10 deals a year, up to 500 deals a year or more, or have a multi-million dollar real estate portfolio already, you should check out our powerful Investor Fuel Real Estate Investor Mastermind. Over 100 of the nation's leading real estate investors are members, and it's not uncommon for our members to 2 to 5x their business just from getting around other members at Investor Fuel. At Investor Fuel, each of us are business advisors to one another's businesses, but we don't stop at business. We focus heavily on becoming better people and living fuller lives. If you're looking for fuel for your business or fuel for your life, please check out Investor Fuel. Dot com. Applications and interviews are required as most investors are not a fit for our community. Please learn more at InvestorFuel.com. If you're not ready for coaching or masterminds but eager to start learning more about investing, please join our private Facebook group by visiting FlipNerd.com Facebook. New members get access to free training from us right here at FlipNerd.com and it's a community to safely ask your questions. A great place to get started. Simply go to flipnerd.com slash Facebook to request your access today.